So this is like the latest I've recorded, mainly because I forgot to rec record because I've been like, it's not so much busy. It's more like I've been just pseudo busy. I didn't accomplish anything today, but I was busy-ish. Also eating dinner. Good evening, everyone. Right now on Zen, it's 10.03 p.m. on Friday, August 28th, 2020. No breaking news today. It's just me or this week. What is it today? Friday? Yeah. When was the last time I played at night? Exactly. I found this really awesome art thing when I was out on patrol the other night. I asked around and nobody claimed it, so I'm gifting it to you for all the awesome stuff you've been doing for us. Igly, you're just awesome. Let me see what this is like. Oh. Do I have to put it on the wall? Tapestry. What does tapestry look like? I think I've also been like slightly dizzy. Also my um Oh it's kinda lame. I thought it was actually art. Okay, did something happen because my controls feel awkward? I don't- I, I, I doubt it? That'd be weird. What is it? Da Vinci's? Like, uh... Man? Painting or whatever? Like, picture? I think it'd be weird if Igly, of all people, just happened to find an, an authentic, like, a uh, Da Vinci. <laughs> I mean, it might be real. Genuine article. Wow. Wow. I think that's the second, like, artwork that Igly's actually given me. I wonder if that has to do with the fact that I've been nice to Igly, like, Pretty conse consecutively, like. Yeah, it's next to Da Vinci. The Ver Vertruvian Man by Leonardo Da Vinci. His drawing is based on the ideal human body ratio stated, uh, stated in De Arctitura. De, De Arctitura was uh, Traditized by Vitruvius, an architect from the early 1st century BCE. Cool. So I have two Da Vinci's. That's pretty cool. Wistful painting. A girl with a pearl earring. Johannes Vermeer. Circa 1665. Also known as a girl with a turban. This piece was ultramarine, uses ultramarine paint, which was expensive at the time. 
it seems the expense was worth it as the vivid blue colors draw the eye and help make the piece a classic. The question is, is that a real pearl earring or something? I know what it is right now, but I'm getting a little dizzy. Probably because I haven't taken my medicine. And we'll do that. Uh, after the recording. Ugh. So sleepy. Hey, you can. Ken the summoner. Okay. So that I'll have fossils uh, to um, uh, examine and sell. Like, I don't know why I can't finish my th train of thoughts. It's just like. I don't know, I'm tired. Uh, someone who's pretty much my sister in law. Um, I say pretty much because it's my boyfriend's uh, sister in law. boyfriend that's been dating for five years. So, it's just a sister-in-law. Okay, so she asked me to make something for her and it seemed really cute but the thing is, oh well, it was, okay so she requested a drawing but she requested a, like a cartoon drawing of her son and the main issue with that is that I don't draw people that well. And if I draw people, it's only women, and women in a certain style. Like there's a, a like, there's an exact style that I draw women, you know. So she wanted her son and a dog. That uh, she wanted. Oh, let me color. She wanted them draw in like a Lilo and Stitch style, and I am not someone that's capable of doing that. So, but I tried. I tried. <laughs> I hate you, Gulliver. Why aren't you going far? There I was, battling a dozen no to, um, <laughs> Kasput. No, actually, I don't want to read this because, um, I feel like Gulliver's is more interesting to read. That. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Oh wait, I can still look for them. I can just say no to you. Okay. That's cute. Okay. I'll bar these are because I just have to like go underwater. Yeah. Now let's check this real quick. Wooden simple thing. I think it's time to sell this stuff. Hmm, 
more pockets. out of it lately like uh I, I did order a philo philosophy test textbook so i think i've been out of drawing lately maybe because i'm just not in the mood i have to be really motivated to draw because i think i realized that drawing is not my passion and that's okay honestly still just be a hobby drawing is a hobby for me I guess this is an unrelated thing about anything, but so uh, I bought a automatic feeder for the cat, MJ, and you know, that's great, right? So I have it set to, you know, eight o'clock in the morning, eight o'clock at night, and I thought that'd be fine, knowing that MJ does like being fed whenever the hell she wants, but I was getting, I was tired of that, so that's why I bought the automatic feeder. Well, I woke up this morning to find out that she tipped over the automatic feeder. And not only did she tip it over, she ate like a fuck ton out of it. And then she threw it all up. So, it's great. so I have to like barricade it so that she can't like tip it over. <laughs> Ahoy there, crew. It's me, your brother from another rudder. So listen, it happened again. Can you swing by and pick me up? Sending my coordinates now. Gulliver out in it. Over and out. Uh, Gulliver. I know. I know. I love you too. I did buy a philosophy textbook online, so like, I think I'll try reading that in, in my off time. Though I did skim through like the, you know, like when you buy on Amazon, you can look inside. The introduction, it seemed to show utilitarianism, okay, you know, the, the subject I've been obsessing over. Well, it didn't. It, under utilitarianism, I saw the word, the name John Stuart Mill. But I didn't see Jeremy Bentham, which, uh, if you know me by now, that pe that kind of made me like instantly not want to buy the book. But I was like, no, no, they, they understanding. They'll probably mention Bentham. 
how the fuck do you put utilitarianism in the philosophy textbook and not mention Jeremy Bentham, right? I'm sure John Stuart Mill, of all people, being highlighted. It's like, John Stuart Mill is the one that was like Jeremy Bentham's student, but I don't like him because he kind of twisted utilitarianism to like his own thing, which is fine, you know, that's your own thing, but whatever. How you doing, Christina? Watching the sky is really fun. Right. It is calm. Oh, okay, actually. Uh, maybe. I don't think I can get that. No. Nope. My roses absorbed it. to the other side. Alright. real quick and then I'll be done for today since I'm already kind of tired and dizzy. <gasps> Ooh. So yeah. These produce purple fanbies. Point proven. Okay. Okay. Then we'll be done for today. We have a lot of fossils that we could go get examined tomorrow and sell them and then sell all these um shelves not the summer shelf but like i could put them in the box but that requires like they i think they take like 20 percent if you put it in the box so those damn twins all right so today's a short episode but thank you for watching um be nice to people and things will get better.